All right. And up next, let's add a nav bar to our project. And in the process, we'll learn how to set up nested routes, shared layout, and index page. Since I want to cover everything step by step, please be prepared to refactor our application a few times. So if I want to nest some routes inside of the another route, I just need to go with the parent route. So notice, instead of self closing the home one, I'm going to go with an opening tag and the closing tag. And then I just decide which routes I want to set up in here. And there's going to be multiple issues with our original setup. The main focus is that now all of these routes will be nested inside of the home one. And basically, they will be relative to whatever we have as a path to a home route. And don't worry, I'll show you also with another example, just so you can see better. Again, we'll refactor our application multiple times. So don't worry, if in the beginning, some stuff breaks. So let's navigate back to app.js. And like I said, I want to nest about product and the error page inside of the home one, because I do want to set up a shared layout. And I want to set up also a nav bar. So let's try this out, where instead of self closing, let's go here, let's say route, and then close it. And as I said, of course, there's a syntax error like so. And like I said, there's going to be multiple issues. If I go to about, I'll actually see the homepage. And yes, that is something we're going to fix in a few videos. Now, the main idea right now is the fact that these are all relative to the homepage. And it's kind of hard to see since this is homepage, since we're doing the setup on homepage. So therefore, let me showcase that if I'm going to go here with dashboard instead, right now, you'll notice that you won't be able to navigate to an about page, you'll have to go to a dashboard forward slash about. So that's the key about nesting routes, where whatever you have here as a parent will be the main route. And then whatever is inside is going to be forward slash and whatever path is over here. So let me save it notice, we cannot see anything. But if we go to dashboard, which is technically our home run right now, and then about then everything technically works. Now we still don't display the about one, but we'll fix that in a second. So hopefully this is clear where again, in our case, we're using as a parent our home one. But for example, if I'm going to go outside of this home one, and if I'm just going to say, Okay, let me set up the dashboard, you'll see how basically this works. Again, you won't be able to see actually, uh, what is displayed in the stats, for example, the page that I'm about to set up but you will be able to see that this is how it works. So element, and then let me go quickly with div over here. I'll say dashboard. Like so and then we want to nest this. So let me go here with the route and then inside of it, we'll set a path. And then whatever path I want. So in my case, I'm going to go with stats. So now we're looking for dashboard, and then stats. So this is how normally we'll nest routes. And again, we won't be able to see this stat div, because we need to add a little bit more logic, which we'll do in the next video. This is just to showcase how this nesting is going to work. And if we're going to go to a dashboard and stats, now you'll see that we'll have this dashboard one, but the route exists. So technically, there are no issues over there. Now, if I go to dashboard, this is what I'm displayed. And now if I go to about again, since our parent over here is the home route, that's why we see the about page again, that's the first step how we can nest routes inside of the parent route. And then whatever we have for a path is going to be the main path. And then whatever we set up over here is going to be the parent plus this value over here. So if you go here with dashboard, then it's going to be dashboard about dashboard product. 
And since in our case, it's a homepage, we go with about and then product. 